Okay, I'm going to be doing my next Arduino project. So I'm going to go to the home page of the Arduino home site, which is www.arduino.cc. Uh, I'm going to go to learning, go to a, this is example. Um, okay, here's some. Uh, Last time I did, uh, I think I did the digital read serial. Um, now, now I'm going to do the analog read serial, which is read a potentiometer printed state out to a Arduino serial monitor. Um, so let me click on that. That brings me here. This is all the information about this type of uh, example and setup. Uh, it's called an analog read serial. Uh, let's see if I can. Uh, okay, this is a little more information about it. Let's see if I can zoom in. Okay. You can go to the home page and examples and read about it. This shows you, tells you about the circuit, tells you what hardware you need. You need the Ar Arduino board and a 10 kilo ohm potentiometer, uh, which I actually have over here. I've got my Arduino Uno, got some jumper wires and some hookup wires. Here's my uh, potentiometer. It's a uh, 10K potentiometer, 10,000 ohm. Uh, and I got my uh, USB to hook this up to program the board to read this. Okay, back to this. Um, this is the, uh, this is the, uh, shows you how to hook it up. Let me uh, zoom in here. too big. Let me zoom out a little bit. Okay, I don't know how well we can see this, but basically this uh, red wire here is your goes to the 5 volts. The black wire here goes to one of the ground pins. So you send send 5 volts power and ground to the potentiometer. And then the, uh, the center pin is your uh, your analog signal, and that goes to the analog in uh, pin zero. And I'll show you a little closer. There we go. You see that all the analogs in and the power section. That's a little better. But okay. So. Right here is how you hook it up. It shows you on the website. And if you read down below, this tells you a little bit about hooking it up and how it works. Here's the uh, schematic. Okay. As you can see, you got ground going to one side of the pot, five volts going to the other side of the pot, and then your the wiper inside the potentiometer as it varies. It sends a sends an analog signal to your analog in. And you go on down below. Here's all your code and everything. Your code. But anyway, that's where you can read about it and how to hook it up and how to do it. But also, once you, once you download the, uh, you go to the, the Arduino software, to where you write all your code at. You go. To, you just click on the icon. It loads make that bigger. Now let me show you, you can come up here to file, go to examples, uh, basics, I'm doing the analog, this one right here, analog read serial, you click on that and it loads the code for you already. So that makes it really easy. 
codes here you can read about it but it pretty much loads the code for you and you're done it's just a matter of, of uh, verifying the code and then uploading it once you have everything hooked up on your board so I'm just gonna leave that there now I'm gonna hook up my board and get it ready here's my board here's my uh, USB cable unplug that in get it ready that's plugged in okay I'm gonna wire up my three wires I've got uh, red to represent my five volts black to represent uh, ground and for my analog input I'm gonna be using a, a green wire so my my black goes to ground which is um, right sec you got one two the second one in is ground so I'll plug that into ground now my my fourth one over is five volts so I'm going to uh, hook up my five volts on the fourth pin one two three four five volts here and over here I'm going to hook it on a zero because that's my signal everything's hooked up good connections here's my potentiometer I'm going to hook this. This will be my 5 volt in ground. And this will be my signal wire. So for this, I'm going to use uh, my uh, alligator clips just because it's a little, a little easier to wire up. So I'm going to push that in all the way and just clamp it down. Now, green to my signal wire. So that's all the way in. And black's my ground. So I got five volts ground and signal now I'm just going to hook this up you know got this going in my board there and everything but uh, I am, I'm just going to do the other end like so Good connection. My ground. Now my signal wire going into the analog output signal. I mean this is the analog input. Sorry. Okay. All right. So let me uh, show you what I got here so far. I got my. I'm just going to hold this in my hand and while I do everything, but everything is hooked up. And I'm going to show you what happens when I plug in my USB. And this should power the board. See some lights come on. So everything's plugged in. Now I just got to um, load this 
load this code to the board. Basically, I just come up here to uh, come up here to verify. This is already the code, it loaded everything. I'm going to click on verify. That's going to compile. Done compiling. Now I'm going to upload this. I'm going to click on that. You can see it's uploading. Um, usually when it's done, these these uh, transmit and receive will flash, and it tells you here it's done uploading. So now I'm going to monitor it. So now I need to go up here to tools and my serial monitor. Okay. Um, now I'm going to hold this potential. I'm trying to get it where you can see both. Now as I turn this, you can see the numbers going down from all the way from 300, 180. It's showing zeros. I don't know if it's showing up on here, but it's zero when I turn this all the way um, counterclockwise. It's zero. Turning it clockwise, it's slowly going up, reading a number. I'm at 500, 600, 700, 800, 900, and all the way to 1,023.